A thieves just hit a Santa Maria History Museum for a second time in less than a month. As News Channel reporter Dave Alley shows us, people there are stunned and they're confused. Once again, the Santa Maria Valley Historical Society Museum is the site of a crime. Two break-ins the past month. Unfortunately, um, my Christmas break was spent here um, dealing with the, you know, the damage and the police reports. Both times, thieves didn't get away with too much. The first, only office supplies and equipment and a little bit of money. Most recently, even less. They got away with our cash box, but again, we only had $2 in it and with a laptop. Since the small nonprofit museum doesn't have a lot of cash or expensive equipment inside, people here are not only upset, but bewildered too. I just don't get it. I think it's just, I'm still, it's a head scratcher. I'm trying to understand and I just, I can't, I can't put my head around it. Just like after the first break in, everything in the museum remains intact leaving those who work and volunteer here grateful that none of these artifacts were either taken or destroyed. They're irreplaceable and there's just so much history. So it's really, I'm really grateful. So yeah, we wouldn't be able to replace these things. In response, the museum is changing money protocols and windows have been reinforced. Surveillance cameras and other security equipment are also coming soon, provided by generous community support. We hope that this doesn't happen again, but we do feel that if anyone tries to break in that they'll get minimum and they will be caught on camera. The museum is currently working with police to find those responsible. In Santa Maria, I'm News Channel reporter Dave Alley.